Hey, Josh Johnson here along with the science kids, these two, that are bundled up like E.T. <laughs> We're going to do a little experiment with water and instantly turning it into ice. So we have two bottles here and my assistants can vouch these are not frozen. These are water, right? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to pick them up gently, really gently. See how it's still water? Mm -hmm. Now what it's looking for is something to freeze to. So, Kessler, give that thing a whack. Uh. Look at that. It is instantly turning into a giant chunk of ice. Whoa. It so cool. It did work. You see it, Charlie? Mm -hmm. See how it's, it's just forming ice. into ice right, right in front of you. It's ice! <laughs> Isn't that cool? It's like... It's try freezing. squeezing it. It's actually ice. The rest of it's freezing right now. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that cool? <laughs> Alright. Charlie, you want to do this one? Mm -hmm. All right, so we pick it up very gently. And then you just give it a whack. Do better. There we go. Whoop. <laughs> <laughs> and just like that, it's frozen solid. You can literally watch it freeze in front of you. Whoa. And you can see the bubbles as it's, like, it's frozen with bubbles. Mm-hmm. Now the bubbles in this are actually really important from a science standpoint. Okay, so we learned in school that water freezes at what temperature? 32 degrees. 32 degrees, as we can see our breath. It's cold out here. Now, but there's another thing that has to happen for water to freeze. It has to be below 32 degrees, but it has to have something to freeze too. And in this case, this is purified water. So I sat it out here the night before and it didn't have anything to freeze to. So this water sat inside this bottle and became what's called super cooled. That's where uh, it's below 32 degrees, but there's nothing for it to freeze to. As soon as the kids hit the bottle, it put some air bubbles in there, which that gave the water something to freeze to. The reason this is important in the atmosphere, this is how freezing rain forms. When freezing rain forms, it falls in the form of a raindrop that hits the Earth's surface and voila, it has something to freeze to, and as a result, you get a big icy mess.